welcome back to my channel i'm court love and today i'm reviewing an amazon company um by the name of ilissy um they sent me uh this wig to review um so basically this is a water wave um 10h ball teapot wig so um for all that don't know what a tea part is it's just basically just a little bit of lace um shaped in a tea basically like right here like all, all that and it stops right there so um you have really no space to kind of like do different uh type of partings unless you shift the wig or something like that um but i decided to just wear it in a middle part and um i put like some bobby pins to kind of clip it back because i didn't like it just hanging down just straight on me i didn't like the way it looked um um but i do love the definition of the curls they're very pretty um what i did to prep the wig um for some crazy reason, I tried to bleach the knots, but they didn't take. Um, and it and the only reason why I did that in the first place is because I had extra bleach um, left over. So I was just um, seeing like, uh, let me see if the knots bleach, but it didn't take to um, the bleach didn't take to the knots and that's not a bad thing i mean because it's a, it's a tea part wig it's not meant to really bleach and you just you know where it's supposed to be um easy easy going just put it on and keep it moving this is not a this is a no fuss wig it's not supposed to be difficult you know i was just trying to be extra and it was an epic fail um so basically all i did like i said to not divert from what i was initially saying um i just kind of like pluck where the lace was to kind of give it like a natural um more natural look to it and also i added some baby hairs um to it and um what else did i do i um put mousse on the hair to kind of define the curls it didn't really need it um but i added mousse to the hair um initially when i um actually got it i co-washed it with just conditioner so um and the curls came out looking you know perfect so um if you're looking for an inexpensive um non-fuss wig this is this is something that you wish you should look into um it's it's nice i would actually get this myself it's very cute i like short hair um this is how it looks if you can see the back um that's how it looks um i i really like it it's it's pretty to me um I can just throw it on. Um, of course, it has like the uh, adjustable straps um, in the back that you can put. It has um, three um, combs, two right here and one in the back to secure it. I, I take all of the combs out my wigs. I don't keep them set for the very back. Um, that's just been a habit of mine since I learned that trick. Um, it kind of like lays the wig flatter if you do that. But I mean, if you prefer to have the the combs in, be my guest. It's all preference. Um, it's not a rule like, oh, I gotta cut the combs out of my wig. No, do as you know, what's comfortable for you. Um, but basically, I, I really like this wig. It's very pretty. Um, I would I would really get this. This is really cute. Um, actually, I had a wig, but I don't think it was water wave. I don't, I'm not sure. It might've been water wave, but I like it. It's cute. 
um, I really like this um, look and like I like the way that I styled it and if I had like um I guess like some other type of clips to put you know just to jazz it up but I'm not really that type of girl that like you know uh flashy stuff in my hair like that's not me I'm you know simple just easy going um but yeah um check them out I'll have all the links um, to this hair um, in the description bar um, if you're interested in purchasing this wig. So until next time, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good day.